this this issue of uh, uh, you see the, the idea behind any um, uh, occasion, okay, is a reminder, and it so it's, it, it doesn't mean that this is the only time that that wa alaykum as salam you give mothers their really really due, but it is uh, and it a good time for everybody to to remember to remember that and i think um, the the whole idea of even the idea of eid okay yes we have these uh, two eids one after ramadan and one during the the, the season of of al hajj but take them as examples take them as the start we took them as the end yeah you see this is the difference <clears throat> Okay, uh, th this is where we become static. The, 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 a life society is a society that is capable of creating more aids for them, for themselves. Y you see, I mean, it may be probably the first time you hear this. Uh, am, am I right? I mean, probably this is the first time. Because we, the, 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 it has been... This is the mentality that prevailed in our society for a long time that things have to be binary. Eid or no Eid. <laughs> you see, this is for me. This Muhammad said it very clearly. There is a specificity for every society. They, they create their own. Okay, so Muhammad helped us. But that is the beginning. Not to tell you, that's it, and don't move further. <laughs> you see what I mean? But I am giving you an example. What, how do you celebrate? What you celebrate, and when you celebrate, and why you celebrate. And what is the, the, the idea of, of Eid, okay, or, or any type of celebration, okay, is really like to... Uh, uh, it reflects, it reflects the ability of the society to recognize. You see, and that should be a dynamic thing. Idea is not like okay, this is only these two eats and stop there. But this is an example, okay. And it's, it's unfortunately it is the same approach when we approach our Quran. They they they, they see something. And they said they think that this is the end of it. It is the start. <laughs> the idea again is to keep the society alive and thinking. Okay, what is really important for them? <clears throat> if I want to study a study a, a, a society, okay, one of them is really what are what do they celebrate? You remember we said okay, you can tell about a society from what they eat, what they drink, what they celebrate, what, what, the, what are their, their aspirations, what are really their dreams. Well, this is how you, stu you study a society. If you find them that they are celebrating thank uh, 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 gratitude or thanksgiving, you say, don't, don't do that. This is a high value. I will be with you. I will join hands with you. Okay? And with time, people will take away the superstitions associated with something. Or you, you see what I mean? Like, like, like what we have seen in medicine. If you look, I mean, deep in history, it was based on superstitions. But as we get more and more knowledge, you see the myth starts really shedding away. So instead of telling them what you were, this is wrong. No, no. Show them the alternative, and the the uh, uh, harmful things, the the uh, the uh, the, uh, the fat <laughs> will, will it, it will go away. Okay. So th I think that's the the spirit that I think. Muslims have to reclaim. It is an occasion for people to come around a very important topic. 
very important matter in, 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 in our uh, uh, life. Is that right? And the, the parents, uh, we know how, how they, I mean, they come re right away after appreciation of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Is that right? Yeah. So they don't, I mean, uh, 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 deserve uh, celebration. You see, again, the idea is how the society will really take these matters seriously and try to, to, to see different ways of uh, 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 attracting the attention of the people around these very important matters in their life. Tell you this this incident that happened many years ago. I I had a very bright student, I mean, uh, specializing in in my specialty. Really very bright, and came from very wealthy, well-to-do family and. Everything is available. And we had a discussion. And I don't know what brought the idea of um, the celebration of birthdays. And uh, I brought a new idea. And she picked it right away because she is very intelligent, very smart. I said, you know, to celebrate birthday, if, if you really think about it, I, I, I told her from the beginning, I am not against <laughs> celebrating the birthday of anyone, okay? But if, we, if I really want to think deeper about it, okay, my birth, I was not responsible for it. I came to this life, I was not even asked about it. So I prefer to celebrate something that I have achieved. Okay? And the, the discussion continues. Wallahi, next day she came to me, I said, Dr. Khair, I was thinking about what you were saying. I, I used to throw the best birthdays, not only for me, but for my friends. But from now on, I will look for something that I will achieve and celebrate. Again, I don't take it in a binary way, either this or that. <laughs> you can do both. I have no problem with that. Okay? But which is higher? And here comes the value of ta'aruf. You get to know another family from another culture, far away from, from yours. I mean, in terms even of distance, I am talking. Is that right? You are from the subcontinent and they are from South America. Is that right? You see how far it is. But thank God that you had an, a situation, an occasion to learn about the experience of another a human being belonging to another culture, okay? And you wanted to understand. I don't know if you had that uh, uh, conversation with these people like, tell me a little bit about this. Tell me the history of this, how it came about. But I can tell you that this is really the, we, you are calling it celebration, but it is really opening a new period in the life of the human being. Like in our culture, for example, or in the Jewish uh, tradition, they celebrate puberty. Is that right? So the, the same concept, but choosing a different time, probably for a girl, may, may mean different from, from a boy or something like that. So it is really the time, okay, you are entering a, a new period in your life. Probably you are getting closer to marriage, for example, when you may be anything. I mean, it, it's, it's really should make us curious and anxious to know. If, yes, the idea of, of 
achievement is, as we said, it's, it's very good. But also there may be another perspective. You see what I mean? That may deserve also alerting this young girl, okay, that you are getting into a new period. What have you done and prepared for this new period in, in your life? A new page in your history. That's, I think, that the, 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 the idea behind it. But I'm, I'm sure that it happens in every culture that these meanings become papered and covered up with the, with the affectations. It becomes, the celebration itself becomes the end point. You see what I mean? What is brought to the party? What type of cake? What, you see what I, the, the, the things from the, the affectations became really the, the end point rather than the meaning behind really the occasion. It happened even in our own Eid. You see what I mean? Eid becomes really a business and uh, uh, I mean the, it's, uh, it, it affected every culture. So in other words, the people have to always be very keen and very vigilant so that these meanings will not go away. This is why I said how you celebrate <laughs> rather than the just mere celebration. And I, I think that by itself deserves really, again, these are the situations when you understand others uh, uh, practices and celebrations and what how what do how they think how it came about historically and how things may have through time distorted this is the, the worst disease that has afflicted us and probably other cultures and religious groups because the emphasis has been on the outward thing, okay? And people start forgetting why we are doing this. And people start paying attention, okay? Especially with the, uh, like the next younger generation, okay? They are, they are more challenged, okay? And they start asking, why we do this and we do that? Why I have to come and pray? And why do I pray in this, way, in this fashion? <laughs> you see, why we have to celebrate this and that? Why, 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 why? And nobody is answering that very important question. Or at least, I'm not expecting a final answer. And I don't believe in final answer. But let it be an, a, an opportunity to start the discussion, start the debate, and the debate has to continue because only then new ideas will emerge. Fear is not going to help us at all. Many times we avoid these discussions out of fear. But in your own experience, did fear protect us? In fact, no. It did not. It did not. Imagine, imagine the United States acted out of fear regarding the internet. It was, there was a time then they can kept it to themselves. Is that right? I mean, correct me if I am wrong. Do you remember that time? Okay. But you see, if you want to, 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 to go forward, okay, and really prevent problems, make it open to everybody. What protected Quran? Fear? <laughs> Openness, it is available. <laughs> yeah. For the people. Did anybody, did he, you hear somebody saying, this is mine? 
It belongs to me? Except us. <laughs> Unfortunately, I mean, but really the, the, the idea was to, to the, because it was popularized, it was protected. This I really want you to remember all the time. Put it in the hands of the people, the masses. Why? Because the people don't have interest. Their own interest is the truth. If you want to protect something, what do you do? Popularize it, spread it. <laughs> in Arabic we say, Asha'a. It became available to everybody. No monopoly. Start to monopolize, and you see the problems. Like wow. This is how Quran was protected. No. Popularize it. 